Okay, well, with the super crazy dragon dudo defeated, I guess we can go ahead and level up a bunch off of a bunch off of that. I mean, we can't go wrong with endurance. Can't go wrong with that. I'll level up mind once for fun, because we might do like a mix with a magic kind of stuff later. Is what we might do. Sure, just put in a bunch of points like that, or a faith one for now. What is the faith increase? It's increasing my physical and uh, versus strike and stuff. By increasing faith, really? Well, this will help us get towards some spicier spells down the line. Anyway, screw it. I'll do it. I'll do it, I guess. Sure. Got several level ups off of that. Cool. I'll take it, I guess. But yeah. So let's just see here. How do you get dragon incantations? Well, there's two. One in Kaled and Limgrave. Okay, so this was the later Kaled one, huh? One well, Limgrave is on the island. Spend five hearts of the Kaled one. You permanently get yellow dragon eyes. Get there from the coast near the beginning of the game. Huh. And benefit to having yellow dragon eyes other than cosmetic benefit? It's cosmetic. It sounds kind of cool, though. But. But, huh. Also, how much does it take to level me up now? Um, almost 20k. Fort Faroth. How about no? How about you don't, actually? Yeah, I probably shouldn't be here at this point, huh? Probably not. How about you don't? Um, what's in there and how do I get there? Well, yeah, maybe I just shouldn't worry about this for now. Or I could just run through like a maniac and see what happens. I mean, oh, I'm on this side of the fiery wall now. I mean, I could spend my runes at the place and not have to worry about things anymore. This is what I could do. And go run through there. Um... I mean, if you jump off the map, I'm pretty sure I just die. I'm fairly certain is what happens. Let's go this way. Something gets knocked around that corner every time I, every time I go through there. Like, so I may as well go ahead and get your other two, whatever the hecks they are. Yeah, these. Yeah, there we go. That's a pretty perfect amount for my runes. Now I have 845. Cool. So... I think most of the creatures ever dealt with are the birds with the big swords on their talons. They're hella annoying. But you're saying that the other dragon is like along the... Are you saying this island? Here? That? Is where I find the other dragon? Like facing cliffs? Maybe? Hmm. -mm. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> that's, uh, that's how it goes a lot of the time. We wind up dying to a lot of janky stuff much of the time. So... If I set a marker for, like, here. Let's see. Let's see. I'll have a look-see over here, because I haven't explored here yet. I don't know if this is the island to which was being referred earlier, but it's still a place I haven't explored yet, so I may as well check it out either way. May as well. Near the beginning of the game? This is near the beginning of the game. This was the beginning of the game, right? Or was it here? This was the beginning of the game. This island here? I can set a marker there. That's two. I still want to explore this other thing, where Bob. So I guess I don't have the thing, where Bob, that you're specifically requesting yet. I don't think. Uh, about the glintstone key. Yeah, I guess I don't have it. Without one, you can't pass through the academy, and you will never reach the Earth Tree capital. Mm, about Selen? Who's Selen? I don't remember. Oh, is that the one behind the Mad Pumpkin Head? Oh, it's nice, nice mythic. That's a massive upgrade there. Look back, Adama. Hmm. Hmm. Can I jump out of here? Maybe. Can I maybe? Sweet. Okay, so... Yeah, one is... Oh, what the heck? What the heck? I don't think I'm getting over there, am I? Um, 
I'm sure I can figure it out if I get if I get closer to there anyway. And yeah, that's a big graphical graphical upgrade right there for sure. Massive upgrade. Whoa, I wish I was getting better performance in Elden Ring with the 3070 here. But alas. Wonder if you wait. <laughs> okay, never mind. I was thinking maybe I could just like take some of the rocks down or something like that is what I thought. But I guess that's not the not the case. Everyone found it if it was was it for the guides? I'm sure I'll find a way, right? Yeah, you just kind of die. <laughs> so it's probably not down that way to that thing or Bob. So I should probably not worry about that for now. Yeah, no idea what's going on with that there. So if I travel to the first step, maybe I can go down to the island there. Or maybe it's just one of those uh, thing where Bob's where you need to find some way to teleport over some way somehow, maybe. Like, hold on. Whoops, that's not the run button there. That's not what that is. I'm sorry, I need your feathers. Because I don't think there's swimming in this game or anything like that. Of the old PS2 slash early PS3 open world games where I go to walk through knee deep water and it'll just immediately die. I wonder if that's how it works in this game. I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, I can test it out. Unless you want to take 3,000 years to find it. So it's something weird then. That's what you're telling me. I can't just go there. Hmm. You're telling me I can't just go across this? Coastal cave goes underneath the water. Well, um, about that. About that, though. <laughs> yeah, we sank really fast. Oh, before I, uh, before I check the video that Guzma sent me as I was about to, it's just now occurring to me, I can probably fight this guy, right? I can probably fight him. This bitch from the beginning of the game. I was pressing Y to acquire materials. Um, I might potentially click off really quickly to turn on the thing, Bob. So that when I die to a roll knot coming out in time, or input buffer or something like that, you can directly see how that took place, you know? Hi! Okay, do I still remember how his attacks work? Probably not. I thought I pressed the B button. Well, um, about that. About that. Um, okay, entrance is along the coast there. Okay, so it is down there at least. I can keep it in mind. But, uh, down this way we go. I'm gonna kill this guy now. Just beat him earlier. I'm gonna take him out now. That's gonna be great and fantastic and everything is gonna be wonderful. Just you wait. So I can get the couple hits initially. Okay. Ow, oh, why is my nose itchy at this time? Okay. Do you mind, maybe? Do you mind? What is this hitbox? Well, um, welcome back to Elden Ring 101, I guess. Welcome back to this. This guy probably won't even give me enough runes to level up at this point. With my current level. Probably just gonna lose all the runes I get from him to a random generic other enemy. But hopefully killing him gives me cool other stuff, I hope. Maybe. I hope. We'll see. Okay. Bonk. What? What kind of weird arc was that there? Okay. Dang you. Wow, thanks, input buffer, for nearly killing me. Glad you didn't, but like, you came really close to killing me there. Stop. Stop! Holy crap! Oh, 
bonk. Whoa, I was rolling! Do you mind? Okay. Okay. Ah, why nose? Why does my nose have to be itchy right now? Okay. Okay, that time it didn't hit me. Okay. Darn you. Don't you dare kill me with something weird. Don't you dare do it. When is he striking down? I have no idea. Okay. There we go. Jeez. I mean, fell. What does he give me, though? Nothing but 3,000. Oh, sweet. I do get a thing. Cool. Golden halberd. I need your materials and stuff. Oh, my goodness. The frame rate. <laughs> yeah, the... Uh, yikes, the frame rate. The performance of this game is... Uh, Still not exactly the best, even after the patches that they put in to uh, apparently make it better on PC and such. But yeah, um, this boss reminds you of a territorial rot part, like a super tough boss right at the beginning of the game. Good old Xenoblade feels there. Just have like a super tough enemy right in the beginning of the <laughs> beginning area and such. But yeah, I never realized how great cameras and games have gotten until they jank up. And then you realize, oh, they used to do this constantly. Yep. Yep. Yeah, game cameras are very, very important. Sorry, I'm gonna need that. I'm gonna need that for future use. Okay, so somewhere down here, huh? Is what I'm hearing. Somewhere down here is what I'm hearing. Don't tell me this kills me. How? Game cameras are something nobody thinks about if they're good, but do think about it if they're bad. Yeah, sounds about right there. Yeah, Elden Ring on PC is not exactly all that great here. It doesn't seem like the PC version of this game is not exactly fantastic. So you want the thing? Ah, oh, well. Yeah, the frame rate is super sketchy here. Did the Skyrim hack? What's the Skyrim hack? Oh yeah, it looks so much better than Cyberpunk 2077 at launch. I mean, the graphics of this game are just fine, even on PC here. It's just the frame rate sometimes that gets all wonky. Is all it is. Like, I have no problem with the graphics here. It's just the frame rate. What do I get here? That seems potentially important. Maybe, maybe. Yeah, just die to fall damage. Sounds about right. Sounds about right with my luck. Where's the thing? What? Wait, is it all the way up there? What the heck? Whatever. What do you need? Hi. I don't want any trouble. Um. There's some notes. Cookbook. I don't know how to get up there again. I'm fast traveling back to get the thing where because it's apparently up on the cliff. Gosh darn it. Yeah, the graphics are definitely really beautiful. Definitely really beautiful there. Okay, let's go right to my uh, thing where Bob. Just so I can afford the stuff the guy's selling. So I can pick up what you're putting down and stuff. So where's my thing? Hmm? Where's my thing where Bob? Why is it up here? weird but i mean sure i'll take it i'll take it i guess there's no way that kills me it seems like fall damage in this game is either it does nothing to you or it kills you there's no in between there exists zero in between when it comes to fall damage in this year video game but yeah imagine a secret boss fight in this game where i have to solve a puzzle that has you decode braille pokemon style match so i've just spent two hours decoding and solving puzzles just spent three hours losing to the boss repeatedly that'd be so miserable yeah. I don't want any trouble. Um, give me the notes. Give me the cookbook. Cool. Yeah. Thanks, man. Yeah. What does this say? Do I even want to know? <laughs> okay. Okay, where's the, um... 
<laughs> Where's the freaking thingy bob? I'll look along this shore here. Maybe it's a secret behind the waterfall, as video games sometimes do. Maybe you're able to make it to the second major area without killing Godric. I've heard about that being possible. That you can just kind of go past Godric if you go like along the side of the castle in some roundabout way or something like that. <laughs> yeah, that message kind of, is kind of around all the time. No. No secret behind the waterfall. Sorry, I need the materials. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Yeah, now I'm super over leveled for this area. Gold pickled fowl foot, huh? What, do I not get the thing more bobs there? The coding Braille side quest is bullshit because Braille can't really be read on a screen. What, is there some, uh, big bad dudo that's bringing you guys back that I need to take out? Something. Hi, silly doggie. Hi. Aww. Hold on. Up here, maybe? Oh my. What? I pressed A to uh, do the second jump here. It's the other way, but now I want to know what this is. Is this just the way back up? I guess this is the way back up if you want a way back up. Okay. Huh. Hmm. Along the cliffside. So you're saying it is up here if it's along the cliffside, or you're just saying like within the cliffs? Down at the down at the shore. And stuff. Ow. Okay, you remember how I said earlier there was no in between? Well, I got pranked. I got pranked there, my goodness. But yeah, let's uh see here. Haven't even beaten the first boss yet, mostly grinds like a trample at the horse guy. I assume you're playing on console there, Anma. I know you've talked about your computer being weird before. Because if it's on PC, I could always help you out with the summon thing, Rob. I don't think this game is crossplay, does it? I don't think it does. But I'm using how they kept the Braille puzzle, but when they were going to do the Arceus event, they decided, nah, that's too complicated. It's more complicated than decoding Braille, then I guess it's good it never got implemented. All the Arceus event was, g was, was go to Spear Pillar and play the Azure Flute. That's all it was. And they thought that that was too complicated for people to figure out, but decoding Braille is fine. Apparently. So, um, there's that. That's all the RCS event was. That's what they thought was too complicated. Oh, there's a thing. Whee! What's that over there? I'll go into the cave, I guess. I guess I'll go into the caves. This is what I shall do. Yeah, I'm looking for this cave here. Oh, that's the, that's the, that. Okay. Whoops. I keep thinking that's a run button. Coastal cave. Okay. Let there be message. Uh, hi. Oh, it's that dudo that I saved that one time, I think, right? You must leave this place at once. They'll rush in and beat you to a pulp. You'll end up just like me. Uh, that's cool. Let me just activate this really quickly before I continue with that conversation. How about? How about I just do that real quick? Hi. Was it the same dialogue that we saw before? Oh yeah, I guess because I reset the reset the thing, Merbob. Oh. Peach Cave, we're here. Time to retrieve the relic fragment. I've seen one of those Braille signs writing that's printed and not textured. I don't think so. Okay, well he just says it over and over again. I see the thing, Merbob here. So that means that there's probably some uh, big bads and stuff here, most likely. Um, yeah, I can't read Braille and even you saw that one. Wait, how is a blind person supposed to read that? Who knows? Maybe I should have put on that light spell thing, Bob. That's why I could have done a yoink. Here's a free colonoscopy on the house just for you. I could put on that one spell. Hi. Ha. Yeah, that might not be a good one. Or that might not be a bad one to slap on. Maybe, maybe. I mean, it might be fine. Might be fine regardless. I'll just go down for now. If I wind up having trouble, then I'll, um... No idea what the heck that is. Oh, I thought that was a projectile coming after me. That was just the runes. That's all that was. Oh, hi. Free colonoscopy for you, I guess. I'm high. What? 
Here we go. Um, why is there always a surprise attack? I don't know. I don't know, man. Maybe I should do the thing. I'm fast traveling back. Gosh dang it, I can't do that. Also, Shuck Ray with a part of three. Nobody expects a Spanish Inquisition. Shuck, who is streaming for the first time in 3,000 years, out here with the raid. I appreciate the raid there, Shuck. I hope the rest of the uh, sinking city or whatever the heck it was went well. Oh, there's a... Oh, cool. I can do a summon. So there's going to be a boss in here? It seems like. But yeah, welcome, welcome, Shuck. Welcome, welcome, 21 DS. And Shuck resubbing now for 25 months. That is a whole lot of months right there. I appreciate the resub, Shuck. You crazy, crazy mad lad, you. Welcome back to Team Enharmonic. Hope you enjoy another month of the emotes and the sub badge. And what the heck is going on here? No. 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 Can I backstab you? No. I cannot do that. Oh, this is a lot of dudos. This is a lot of dudos, but, um... It's been uh, really so crud. Um... I don't know what I was expecting for a boss here, but it certainly wasn't this. Thank goodness I'm over-leveled for this one at this point, but, um... But yeah, I hope the streaming stream went well. Miss your two-year mark. Shame, shame, jail for suck for 200 years. <coughs> now I'm coughing. Got something stuck in my throat. <coughs> what have you done to me? My goodness, you missed the two year there, Shuck. A little bit over two years now. But you missed the actual two year milestone for shame. For shame, I can't believe this. I can't believe you've done this. Well, let's just smack a root. Oh, I should have gotten the crit and stuff. Good luck with this fight. Took you three attempts. I got tailoring tools. Sewing needle. Sounds cool. Um, around level 30 when you beat it. Yeah, with that many dudos, it does seem a little bit tricky. My friendo's still here? Nope. Nope, she doesn't seem like. Um, yeah, I'll take it. Elden Ring is frustrating, but fun. <laughs> is what it pretty much is. Are you surrendering? Do you want a free colonoscopy on the house? Here you go. They're just giving them away. Look, I'm honestly doing you a favor. Turn to entrance, but what if I don't want to though? Sounds about right for a Souls game. Yeah, that's uh, pretty much what it is here. Have you? Did you ever get around to continuing with Dark Souls 1, Chuck? Or just the little smidge at the beginning and then never again? Did you wind up doing the thing? Hi. Smoldering butterfly. Um, yeah, I really should have brought that light. Is what I should have done. Gosh darn it. I should have brought that light spell thing where Bob... You have to find the cord for the controller. Oh. Yeah, that would certainly be helpful there, wouldn't it? That would most certainly be helpful. Ah! Ah! Dragon ahead. Okay. Sweet. Took you two attempts to think you're at level 10. Wolf spirits help you. Oh yeah, spirits. Wolf spirits seem like they could be super helpful in that fight there. But yeah, Dark Souls is super good playing it as we speak. Playing good old DS1. So I don't need this marker here anymore. Now I can fast travel back and use the light to go through the caves that I no longer need to go through. So there's a thing or bob over here. So I'll go and yoink that real quick. No, I want the materials and stuff. Sorry, but I need the thing. Okay, so there's that other dragon. So we took down the harder dragon already. And this is the easier dragon here, apparently. That unlocks dragon stuff. I did the thing. I did the thing. Wow. Also with that tailoring kit thing, Rabob, I can apparently alter garments now. I mean, alter it. Altered. Oh, so it's like altering the appearance of that kind of look if we want it. I like my current thing and my current cape. That's interesting, though. That is interesting. Church of Dragon Communion, huh? Examine altar ritual of dragon communion So this is where I redeem the dragon hearts, huh? Channels dragon to bite foes before caster. There's 24 faith and 16 arcane there, huh? So these are things I'm gonna want to level up if I want to do those I'm doing pretty all right. Today's been a pretty laid-back day after staying up super late with a uh, explorers of sky last night Channels dragon to spew flame breath. That sounds cool That sounds cool are you, uh, 
No, you're a statue. So the other one is around here somewhere, though. Apparently, from what I hear. That one message just said ahead. But I didn't see anything ahead there earlier. Hmm. Hmm. So the other one is on this island somewhere, you say? But minute where you're at, you're gonna head to bed. Thanks for the fun stream, everybody. Have a good one. All right. Appreciate you stopping by and hanging out, Mythic. I appreciate the resub once again. Hope you have an awesome rest of the night. Is there anything down there? There's turtles. And stuff. Hmm. Hmm. Whoa. Let's not fall off the cliff here. Let's maybe not do that. I need materials and things. I need the thing where Bob. Thank you. Oh, that's a rock. That will be a rock there. My god, a rock. Okay, golden rune. So, where? Where is Mr. Dudo, huh? You didn't see any dragon here? But you said the other dragon was here. I could have sworn. Or were we just saying that this was the place to come to, like, redeem my uh, cool dragon points for cool prizes through the cathedrals here? Oh, I thought you were saying the other dragon was here. This is what I thought you were saying earlier. Hmm. Okay, well. I guess we have access to the cathedral now. So I guess there's only like the 10 dragon hearts total. The uh, five that we got from that one. And there will be five from one somewhere in here. Or something like that. Maybe, maybe. So I could redeem some of them here already. But if I can't use them for a little while anyway. There might not be a massive, massive point in doing so. Okay, well. Oh, should I go back to this thing, Rebob, and talk to Mr. Dudo? Um, didn't find any dragon. Thankfully, you would have been annihilated. I mean, the one dragon that we took on just didn't really do anything. Just had a bazillion health and just sat around and didn't do anything. So, I mean. What? Oh, here's a sewing needle. Is that what I think it is? You got it back for me. <laughs> okay, gotcha, gotcha. Well, now we have access to it. Here you go. What? I, I did it, right? <sighs> what made you go and do a thing like that? My mum was a seamstress. And that sewing kit was all I had to remember her by. I always wanted to be just like sweet old mum. <sighs> then I s suppose I... I can't just curl up and die, can I? Okay, also, how many runes did I get for the thing, Robobo? Oh, well, thank you. Not a massive You're ton. Very kind. I always wanted to be a seamster like, like my mum. Then I suppose I. Well, um, will you be somewhere else when I do this then? Maybe? I see something wild and funny. What? Is there something around here? Where do I want to go now? Is the question. Now where? I haven't explored into here yet. I think I saw one of those big bell guys around here when I was exploring off camera, I think. I don't remember. I could uh could always explore there. Could always explore around this way. I haven't really done a whole lot this way yet. Ah, so this all would connect up if I managed to properly connect it up and get like the map and stuff. Sure, I'll go this way and inspect a little bit over there is what I'll do. Sure, let's go explore. There's a thing here? Wait, did I never get this before? What is this? Sacred tear. Oh, why did I never get that before? Did I just never notice it or something? So you know this swamp area to the right of the beginning area? There's a small set of ruins there. Head there and there's small underground ruins with the chest. Oh, I can head there in a little bit. I want to... uh use this here real quick cool okay yeah just making sure i didn't have any others and forgot about it so now yeah flask of crimson tears plus three so yeah let's go inspect over here real quick is what we'll do yeah because there's that guy so i saw him walking around off camera and stuff but i was like i don't want to do anything with this guy while uh while i'm not streaming a streaming is the thing you wink I'll go ahead and do that. Um, I need the things. I need the thing where Bob's. I wonder if this is the one that Mortis was talking about in terms of like smack the thing where Bob's off its legs. 
I do wonder. Hmm. Crafting materials. I want to open the chest. The craziest thing ever will happen. Oh, no. I'll go there after I inspect Mr. Stip Stompin' guy over here. Is what I'll do. I'm going to go see what's up with Mr. Stip Stomper over here. But then, uh... <laughs> and then I'll go check out the thing for Bob. If I can even do anything with Mr. Stip Stomper here. If I even can. Okie doke. Oh? Come on. Okay. So I can one shot if I do that. It seems like. What's this? What is this? Yoink. Brass shield. Okay. I sure hope it's not a mimic chest. I sure hope not. Ow. Darn you. Darn you. Ow. Okay. So, um... Not actually a mimic chest. Well... So this wasn't the one to, like, smack some... Oh, it is the one to smack some stuff off. Okay. Okay. Oh, barnacles. Oh, come on. Gotta smack a the spear barnacle thing mobs or something, I guess. Is this a bit loud? I'm looking on OBS and it looks like it's pretty loud. I mean, maybe this would be a little bit easier if I do this. Maybe, maybe. So that should be that leg done right. I can go ahead and do that. I still haven't tried this glintstone pebble. Imagine he steps on me. Ow, even doing that hurts me. Wow. Well, come on. Come on. There we go. Maybe I do have to be here then. Maybe I do have to be on torrent in that case. Okay, it's not that loud. That's good to hear because it looks decently loud on OBS. Okay. What are you doing? Was that considered enough? Do I not need to do all of them? I guess I don't need to do all of them. I guess I don't need to do all of them. Is that a case? Okay, good to hear that the audio sounds fine. So, what is this? So, what is this? Oh? Let's see here. I'll try the glintstone pebble. So, it's that, huh? So, it's that thing, Rebob. Examine remains. Remembrance of the Grafted. With the Remembrance Duplication menu, you can duplicate remembrances you've previously acquired. This includes remembrances from which you've already drawn out power. Duplication can only before, be performed once per mausoleum. Ah! So that means that you can get both of the, uh... Both of the weapons from, uh... The Grafted... Dudo thing or Bob. Ah! Okay. So that means that now we can get both of Godric's weapons from the from the thing or Bob. Is what that means. Okay. Yeah, that seems pretty handy. That seems pretty important there. Neat. Okay, have I been up there before? Well, I'll go ahead and check up there then. Because that looks like a place where a Sight of Grace would probably be, right? That seems like a place where that would probably be the case, right? Bill is set on Mage Bill, and that's why it's super OP for you. Good old Mage stuff. Ow! Okay, pick up item. Another brass shield. Oh, bolts. Bolts and stuff. Banjo-Kazooie nuts and bolts. Everyone's favorite game of all time. Come on. Come on. Darn you. I'll take that, thank you. You want a free colonoscopy? No? Oh, I should try using this glintstone, this glintstone pebble. Thing where Bob is what I should try using. Fourth Church of Marika, huh? Yeah, there is a thing where Bob here. As I suspected. And then, is this another sacred tier? Yeah. Cool. So these seem like good places to hit up. It definitely seems like. Seems like very good places to explore to. So then, flasks. Let's go ahead and increase the amount replenished by flasks. There we go. Cool. 